Texas Music Interactive. We've got Phil Hamilton here in studio with us. All right, Phil, I know you said you got a new record you're working on. You're getting ready to release it. Uh, you wanted it out in September. That wasn't going to happen. So now you're looking for, Sept uh, for, uh, for January. You've got new songs ready for it. How about you give us one of those new songs there on your pretty little guitar? On my pretty little guitar. Have you named your guitar? Is your guitar named? No, I probably should have, but I've never named her. It's a rule. I guess you're supposed to. But. Persephone. For who? Let's Persephone. See. That's That should be your guitar's name. Oh, Stephanie? Is that what they're saying? Per Persephone. Oh. Persephone. That's what I'm saying. Oh, that's what you're saying. Yeah. I'm sitting here looking on the chat like, who like, said that? Who's saying Stephanie? That's hard, to, that's hard for me to even say. Persephone? Per I'll, is it a P? Or I'll is it explain it to you or? later. Oh, okay. Anyway. Phil Hamlin, got some new stuff you're working on. Tell us about the song and uh, and and give us a little preview. This one's not too new, but it's it's new and it's going to be on the record. Uh, it's the it, it just um, as of a few weeks ago is going to be the uh, title tr uh, title for the record. Um, so it's Renegade Rock and Roll, and uh, it's a fun little jam. So. Cheap hotels and cheap whiskey, bottles on the floor. Another night in Houston, I'll be back next month for more. You may not like my music, you may not like my songs. One thing for sure, you're gonna remember me when you're gone. But I don't do it for the money, if I did not go broke. I'm just out here trying to make a living. It's called a renegade rock and roll Smoky bars and shady women Knocking on my door She says I've been here All night knocks me to the floor She says I like your music I sure do like your songs One thing for sure You're gonna remember me when you're gone I don't do it for the money If I did not go broke I'm just out here trying to make a living It's called Renegade Rock and Roll Oh, that's what it is, come on Well, my friends, they try to tell me I Better slow down it was going to catch you, son, and burn you to the ground. But I don't do it for the money if I did not go broke. I'm just out here trying to make a living. It's called a renegade rock and roll. So I don't do it for the money if I did not stay broke. Just out here trying to make a living It's called Renegade Rock and Roll Renegade Rock and Roll from the one and only Phil Hamilton. Now, hey, Phil, tell us a little bit about the song. Tell us about Renegade Rock and Roll. Man, uh, you know, Renegade Rock and Roll kind of came to me. Um, we were... Uh, you know, doing the Texas music scene and, and the, all this kind of stuff, we, you know, it's, it's, um, I've said it before, uh, it's not, it's not about like pretty setups and big stages and all the time. I mean, there's some of those that you get and, you, and yeah. they're, they're great when you show up, but a lot of it is, you know, just small hole in the wall, you know, clubs and, uh, you know, and just blow and go and you do your thing, you set up and you roll with the punches and it's not always perfect. And, you know, there's definitely their share of problems that, I'd say in the other side of the world of, of music, uh, you don't, you know, you don't, everything's perfect when you show up. It's all big yeah. crews and big productions and, you know, it's not really how it is. And if not, is. people get fired. Yeah, yeah. exactly. You You're know, like, there's, there's someone in charge of that. So there's not that, you know, that, that kind of thing here. You know, yeah, there's ways that you make things right, but it's, it's tough. You know, you have to adjust for the rooms and all the different things you do. And, you know, it's just, it's blow and go, set up, play, and then, and then you roll to the next town. And so... 
for us, we, we kind of, I'm sure we're not the only one to have ever said it, but it just kind of, we coined it, you know, renegade rock and roll. It's like, that's what we're doing. It's just, it's quick and you do your thing and you meet some fans and you build it and you just keep going and it's grassroots. And so it just kind of, that's kind of how it felt. And this was just kind of a song, a, a fun song about what it's like and, and uh, how it kind of feels. You know, you may not like the music, but here's what we do and we hope you enjoy it and, you know, hope that you remember who we are when we leave. So. Cool. Now, now with the Renegade Rock and Roll theme, you know, thinking about you know playing these little dives or whatever else, have you ever been like really scared, like you're pulling into a venue and you're like, where the hell am I? Oh, and absolutely. I think I'm going to get shot. <laughs> Luckily, I haven't had one of those in a while, but uh, but definitely we've had our share of a few uh, that um, you you want to go and uh, get the pistol uh, off the off the off the bus and just make sure nothing happens when you're loading in it's pretty bad are, are there any towns that's kind of that, that, that you find that more often than than uh, other towns you know i would san say san angelo maybe you know i wasn't so scared of san angelo uh you know it wasn't that bad um gosh man it's been a while we haven't had anything bad in a long time but i would say there was a couple of uh couple stuff in Oklahoma that were in, in East Texas. There was one uh, I won't mention that was pretty Is it bad. because you heard the dueling banjos playing? Is that what it was? In, yeah, they were in, making DP mountain Texas? like moonshine in the, other, in, the, in the hills, you know, and, you know, look. And then you scary. turn around and you're like, oh, it's just Whiskey Myers. Hey, yeah, guys, what are just, you doing? What are you, going, what are you guys what are you doing? doing? Cody, how's you doing? Yeah, but, you know, for the most part, I look pretty scary anyway, so I'm sure I'd fit right in. <laughs> but Yeah, <laughs> well, well, look at that smile. Doesn't that look like a scary <laughs> SOB right there? Well, you I know. try not to smile if I have to look tough. No. What, what you um, what you got to do? See, is is your beard is a little too kept? Yeah. Too to look scary. Yeah, I try to you, keep it under control. You, you you need to let it go crazy mountain man grizzly Adams esque. Yeah. I'm, I'm thinking then about. Then I think he would be scared. I'm actually thinking about uh, letting it go for a few months, why? Because it's cooling down. It's getting me excited. So I, for me, that's a cool thing. I feel like now it's time to let it go a little bit. When, when you said it. let it go. You you got me really excited because I was thinking you meant let it go no, as in I'm, go away. No, I'm not um, gonna I'm not gonna cut any uh, any of the beard uh, well, for a while. Well, look, hold on, I, I I've got a deal for you. What if I give you a dollar every day for the rest of my life if you let me cut your beard? Can't do it. A dollar every day for the rest of my life. I may live till I'm 175, Phil. I can't do it. I can't do it. I want to I want to shave your beard. I want to shave your beard and cut your hair so bad you have no well, idea. Well, I'll tell you this: when, <laughs> when the time comes, when the time comes for the right uh, benefit or kind of uh, you can give that dollar a day to any charity you so choose. No, but the, for the right occasion, you will be the first to do it. Either a on stage at a show or on air. So check him out, guys. PhilHamiltonMusic.com, and um, let's try to get him to shave his head.